right enter your register numbers good afternoon what about others right and we'll start Right. Is it visible? PPT. Yes, sir. All right. So now unit three will be starting. Direct manipulation and virtual environment. So these were the third unit. Now we'll see what is there in this. How it will be working. We have to see now. So now, so what is called the manipulation? What is manipulation? Surya Prakash. Surya Prakash is there. Prashant. 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 Vishal. Yes, sir. Hello. Uh, what is manipulation? What do you say? What is the meaning for manipulation? Sometimes manipulation means changing, sir. Changing, changing something. Yes. Changing something. Suppose if I am saying something, again you, you can uh, tell to somebody, again you can interpret or you can uh, manipulate that. Yes, are changing one place to another place also we can say that so that is called the manipulation direct manipulations so for example in our computer language can you say anything manipulations what we are doing in example we shall with respect to cs computer science Vishal. Yes, sir. Uh, can you give any example? Right. I'll tell you now. So manipulation is the thing, but for, for example, if you are you have the word, so you have the you have the program. Best example laboratory programs are there. So when you are typing, what will happen in your editor? Surya Prakash. Yes, sir. Now, uh, what, sir? I called you long back. Now you are responding. Now you are joining. I just saw WhatsApp and joining. Yeah, us. yeah. You should be there in my class first. My first name, Surya Prakash, only I will call. <laughs> hmm. So, what is the meaning for manipulation, sir? Uh, that's what Paresh just told us, sir. Hmm? You are not Paresh. there that time. No, you tell me what is manipulation. Paresh used to do, sir. Paresh used to do it, huh? Yeah, sir. Manipulation. What? What he has done? Manipulation. If he doesn't have petrol in his bike, he'll manipulate me and take money from me. Oh, very good. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that is what he'll be doing. Yes, sir. All right. So manipulation is nothing but something doing differently. So, for example, if you if I'm giving laboratory program, for example, so whenever you are typing in your editor, what will happen? It will be visible there. So that also called manipulation only. So that means what you are typing here, 
and it will be visible for us. So you are manipulating. That means what you are typing the data. So you cannot say. So sometimes what will say, sir, I have told something, but he has manipulated and he has given now. some other information to my friend that is the reason we got clash and we got uh, we, uh, we went for fight all these things sometimes we say so there is also called manipulation only so here with respect to manipulation is nothing but what uid use interfaces with interfaces what manipulations you are doing for example if you have excel sheet what will be happening you will be doing many calculations there many manipulations so that is also called manipulation only so i am having some you you have some of the rows and some of the columns i want to find out uh, uh, using the conditions whether uh, how many student got uh, more than 70% of the marks in external examination or internal marks who were scored less than 20% 50% of the marks we want to conduct the uh, remedial classes so something like that so that is also called manipulation only so entire data is there we are manipulating we are doing performing some task and we will be getting that that is also called interfaces so how you are getting the interfaces this one so that is what this unit will be learning that is called the virtual environment also so virtual environment what we are being also virtual we can say so end of the class end of the unit will come to know still very clearly what is the direct manipulation and virtual environment so direct manipulations so direct manipulations in the sense when you have the program you have the editor you are seeing and typing here there it is visible so you are manipulating the informations from one end to another you are giving the interfaces so next after typing you are compiling and you are running all these things are called interfaces only because program is somewhere you are you human we are human beings we are typing and editor it is visible so you can able to see and you can able to edit or you can able to modify or you can able to save it then finally you can run the program then you will be getting some output all these things interfaces only that is what exactly we will be learning so now virtual environment no need to say i hope what we are doing all these things virtual you know that how it will be working what we are doing now so now let us see what is there in this how it will be working what type of examples they have taken and we have to learn it so here is just you should have the fascinate to do the interfaces in with respect to computer science field so we should have the fashion to learn or fashion to interface each one to one then we will be getting the different results or different tasks or whatever it may be now you people are doing iot projects you might have purchased sensors you might have purchased arduino board or whatever it may be so you are doing all these things are called interfaces that is also called interfaces so that means what you had the fascinate to do the mini project or you have the in you you had the interest to learn the new things that is what all these things fascinate only so that means what towards to learn the new things what fascinate you are having that is what the interfaces we need to discuss in this positive feelings associated with a good user interfaces what is the positive good interfaces we should have this is one day mastery of this interfaces so master where you are having that you are giving the interfaces all these things one to one one to one that's what arduino board you are having interfaces is sensors you are having and programming is one side and the human beings are sitting in front of the computer we are typing the code and we want to execute that code and we want to show the something results that is called all these things called the first one next is competence in performance uh, performing the task so you should you should have the competency so you should have the knowledge you should have the energy the energy in the sense knowledge with respect to that particular field to perform the particular task so that is called the competency of the performing the task next is easy in learning in systems originally in assim assimilating advantage advanced features so here is assimilating the advanced features so in a particular field so you are learning the knowledge you are gaining the knowledge you are learning the new things and you are executing something now iot projects may be new but you are executing and you are showing some results in that so finding something and showing something so you should have the easy of learning uh, see using the systems and you have to show something confidence and the capacity to retain masterly over a time so you you should have the confidence to show the good results 
to get the master in that enjoyment in using the systems so enjoyment in using the systems so we should have interest we should have the interest first then only we can learn something so if you feel hey, why you want to learn all these things if you think we cannot learn it so we should have interest to learn then only we can learn it so then only we can enjoy the work so first we should have the interest then we can enjoy we can perform the particular task next is eagerness to show the systems off to novices so desire to explore more powerful aspects of the systems so this is what the introduction so you should have the positive feelings that means we should have the positive feeling so i can be able to do it that way so we cannot think always the negatives maybe whatever you are getting whatever you are thinking so maybe some or one or two cases maybe failures will be happen so we should not bother for that so if you are assuming you want to you if you are assuming one project you are doing something new things doesn't matter here so maybe the duration 6 months is their semester so maybe it will take one or two days one or two months to learn the new technology so then you will be identifying what are the equipments is required and what are all the interfaces are to be done all these things you will be learning maybe some cases we may not be getting exact output what you thought it so no problem so whatever you have learned that is called that is not that is what you have learned it so that is what the confidence you should have so no problem so in some cases goes wrong also nothing will happen so always 100% succeed in our life that is not possible so in our life also success failures all these things mixing will be there so we have to go ahead that's it so once failure comes we should not feel bad then how to rectify that how to get the output values we have to think over that so here in education system you have the semester systems so small small problems only we can be able to solve so once you enter into the industry there if it is not possible one day then you can take one or two days then you have to solve that sir so that is what the happening next examples of the direct manipulation systems so direct manipulation systems is nothing but with respect to uid what all the interfaces can be done where and all we have done it so already first unit we had discussed but still some more points are there let us see how it will be working so first one is all these things we had discussed in the first unit but let me read out what is there in this so training times with the display editors are much less than the line editors so training uh, training times with the display editors are much less than the line editors so line editors will be different and the training times with display editors are different so it will be showing the different all these things are called manipulations can be done so line editors are generally more flexible and powerful so line editors is more flexible so their line by line will be there so everything it is easy to manipulate that is what they they tell you the advantages of w y s i w y z what is what you said is what you gain is what you said is what you gain is word processor so display all fill pages of the text display all full pages of the text so here is advantages is nothing but what word processor is nothing but what will happen is what you said is what you get is so here is display all full page text so in your word processor what will happen so whatever you are typing so you now you i am having the ppt one page so whatever i have typed it here everything it will be visible for me even for you also you can be able to see one ppt one page at a time so that is what they display a full page text either word or point or excel whatever it may be next is display of the documents in the form that will appear when the final printing done so when you want to do the printing so you want to see the preview so either margins are perfect or not left hand side right hand side top bottom all these things we'll see the preview then we'll go for the print out that is what the second point display the documents in the all the form that it will appear when the final printing done is done show the cursor actions see when i'm moving here cursor actions to be done so i want to go to the next page i can move it i can go to the 
previous phase i can go ahead so on these things cursor action can be done control cursor motions through physically obvious with intuitively and natural means so control cursors motions through physically so physically moving and whatever we are influencing whatever we are doing so obviously it will be working that one use of the labeled icon for actions use of the labeled icon for actions next one is display of all the results of an action immediately so display the action so sometimes what will happen systems when we are switching on so it will take time sometimes sometimes if it is why does all these things so morning it is happened for me so it took 5 to 10 minutes time to open that one so will sometimes will be um, will get angry so why this system is not working all these things so that means what so we are used for that immediate should be happening immediate should happen the activities that is what they display the results and action immediately so now we don't have patience to wait patience to wait provide rapid response and display so you have to provide the rapid responses and displays next is offer easily a reversible actions so offers easily offer often is easily reversible actions also can be done so now examples of the direct manipulations so four five topics are there in this we'll see one by one what will be happening so examples of the direct manipulation so manipulation we have done it so we have we have we had discussed about the what is manipulation so something will be changing so you know the meaning for the manipulation is also english so manipulation is nothing but changing from one to one action to another action that's it so here is word processor history and current status so what is the word processor and current status the we see call so that is called the spreadsheet so that is called one name so whatever you have the excel sheet whatever we will call the similar type uh, we see call spreadsheet and its discretents so office automation history and spatial data management so video games computer aided design the continuing evaluation of direct manipulation these are all the seven examples are available in the examples of the direct manipulations now let us see what is oh, how it will be working one by one we'll see it the first one is examples of the direct manipulation systems word processing so wysi wyz so i hope you got mail also today so what are today's class have given already i have set the questions you can see and you can write it that questions also so only two questions have given so one is called list out another one is called uh, one more abbreviation i have told it so you can listen and you can write it now what you can able to see here prashant reddy prashant reddy he is not responding on just to from the beginning i called him he has not responded only prashant ishashwini ishashwini paresh paresh ah Who is responding now? Paresh. Unmute not be kai sir. Huh? Unmute not be kai thala sir. Yeah, you have to make unmute and talk. Are? Yeah, I did sir. It took like two seconds for it. Okay, okay. So last I called you, okay, you are responding. Prashant and Ashishwini did they didn't respond only. So I hope they are uh, nicely. They had lunch and uh, they are sleeping. I hope. Afternoon, sir. Okay, sir. No problem. Paresh. So you can able to see one window. Now what is that called? What you can say? Direct manipulation system, sir. Huh? Uh, you are talking about the direct manipulation system, sir. Ah, uh, no. Down some some diagram is there. What is that? Uh, what you can? Uh, the orientation of it is alignment. 
mm. aligning temporal data by uh, sentinel events mm. we can see sir mm. right so here is examples of direct manipulations now you can make mute yeah yeah, sir. yeah. whenever i am calling then you can unmute unmute and talk so here is direct manipulation systems is wysi wyg is nothing but what you said is what you get what you said is what you get so that means what so here is word example you have done it so what will happen there whatever you are typing whatever you are setting so what you get it so there you can see that is what the here is they have done it one paper that such so whatever they have typed it they made it two columns even we can do it this so you might have done it two columns how to make it three columns how to make it so that is what so here is top is nothing but what is there all the menu menu items are there so you may be having for example file home insert to paste layout to references so mailing go view view design all these things options are available so which way you want you can design you which way you want to can set the paper page setup all these things can be done here so here one example they have given is manipulations for the word processing word processing in manipulation is nothing but what so you have the documents you have the information you have the text that how you will be typing and how you will be setting so that means what first normally we will type it as it is for example paper if you want to put it somebody they will say you have to follow the iwe format so iwe format they will give a oh, font size should be heading should be something and next one is uh, author names also how to write the author names also they will tell it in that so one one publisher one one way they will be taking and font size all these things they will be given next is abstract if you take it and what is the font size and next is what is the font size all these things will be given in detail so based on that you will be designing the sheet and you will be entering that's all so inside the text probably 10 or 11 will be there so that you will be typing i uh, will making the font size is 10 or 12 according to that then you are entering the information so here this is called one manipulation this is called the interfaces what you are doing you have the notebook or some books or referring books or whatever it may be and you are doing some programming one end and you have the editor and outputs you have saved somewhere and finally you are coming back to the word and there you are typing the titles and author names and you will be writing the introduction uh, abstract to introduction uh, next is uh, uh, experiment so so which way you want methodology conclusion so results so so like this four five headings whatever the implementation may be one or two points or three four modules if you are there you can write it three four modules all these things can be done so abstract you know what your projects will be doing briefly you are telling and conclusion what you are done that you will be writing so what you will be going to do it will be writing abstract next is introduction what are all the existing systems it is available what are all the recently they have done based on that work you will be writing in that next you will go for the methodology implementations then finally results conclusions so next will conclusion only feature enhancement also can be written that's what we have discussed last class also feature enhancement also to be written that is what you are suggesting for the next researchers what they have to do it that is what should be done every uh, research so now when you are doing any work so what it can be done for the next that is what i have done so this is what the word this is what one example so examination also same thing just write some window and put some boxes and write some save or at least on five to six menu menu items something like this you have to write it and write some documents that's it so this is what the manipulations and examples of the direct manipulations you have the technologies that derive from the word processor what are all the technologies so one when you are typing what you can be done what you are doing that so that is what they you will be doing so when you are typing first one is called the integration so what is that called integration integration is nothing but what what is called integration what is integration 
combining so you have the text is you have typed it and results somewhere programming is somewhere interaction is somewhere all these things you are integrating integrating one to one so one to one you are giving the link when you are typing the documents either projects or papers or report whatever it may be so you are combining one to one so that is called the integration modules also are there you are combining that you are how you are integrating how you are giving the link between one to another that is called the integration next next is desktop publication software so desktop publication software so publication software what and all is then you have the latex so many software are available even you can use that also so publication software next is for demo purpose we will be using the slide presentation software so slide presentation software so you can upload it slide software presentations authors sometimes we can download from that so they have done it so a very ui some cases they have given it so that how to use it how to do it how to upload it all these things they have done it so that is what the slide presentation software next is hypermedia environment hypermedia environment so hypermedia environment is nothing but you have the media so different medias so way of technology so now what we are communicating this is called one media so that is nothing but the online classes through google meet so one one way so examination when we when you are writing you are taking the question you are typing it and you are uploading there is also called one media so that is called the hypermedia environments so different environments different platforms we can say so improve the macro features improve the macros so features is nothing but so how you will be giving linking how you will be executing all these things can be done next is you have the spell checker and results so spell checking it is available in word all these things are available how to utilize that next is grammar checkers so grammar checking how you will be doing also you know the ms word all these things this is one of the examples for the word processing so word processor one example so what are the technologies you are using so word processor or notepad ppt any one example can be taken and you have to write it for the manipulations interfaces how you are doing so this is one of the one example next is the second one so second one is nothing but v a s i c a l c cals so there is nothing but like excel whatever we are calling currently the similar type is excel sheet they have given some other name and some other technology that is called the like excel sheet it will be working this that is called the vc cal calculator the actually that one so spreadsheet spreadsheet is nothing but you have the rows and columns so and its descendants so and its descendants so what are all the operations you are doing for that that is called the descendants so vasi calc is nothing but what that is type of one calculator so using the spreadsheet so how to do it that one now we have to discuss this one so now before telling this just we will see the example what will happen so what is this called sura prakash anusha yes sir hmm sura prakash you are here only what is this diagram what diagram that excel sheet spreadsheet yes sir so you have some of the rows some of the names some of the data so using this can be done manipulation so excel sheet already even some cases we will enter it in all internal marks in that and uh, what best example is i have sent the internal marks for you people so i have entered what i have done is column or row wise i have entered the marks last row the total marks so, so auto sum how you use it so what will happen whenever i am entering the question marks automatically it will be adding the marks so that is the reason one or two cases first somebody written six questions in that case one more question answer also added so in that case i have seen that then i have deleted the total marks only i have entered 
so that is also called the spreadsheet so here you have the rows and columns and this one so nowadays whatever we will call it as called big data analytics so whatever you have the data in terms of that is what we will call it as csv files so when you are getting from the net all the data csv files it will be there you have to download that and you have to extract the data and you will be utilizing for that so on csv files how to download that and how to get the data all these things we should know how to write the extract the data so that manipulations you will be doing so finally you will be coming to the statistics and so now many people are doing covid pandemic patients so that statistics statistics also they are doing so with respect to particular area how many people are increasing or how many people are dying every state central government they will be collecting the informations so how many people got affected every day they are updating so they are isolating the people so this type of disease is there you need to take care otherwise it will be difficult so all these things they will be doing the cal this one only so finally they will be telling day wise also statistics weekly wise statistics monthly statistics and they will be putting the graph so so and so first month how many people expired how many people died so next month or next week so you can analyze the data what happening so what precautions to be taken if the death rates are more so what government has to take care what doctors has to take care so that is what the all these things analytics they are doing that is what will whatever you call it as big data analytics or whatever it may be so manipulations can be done using the spreadsheets also so there one type of manipulation word excel so you have the messages you have the informations you are doing so here you have the some of the calculations some of the informations that how you are extracting the informations that you should need to learn it so that is what the informations now we'll go back to this so what you can be done here i can add the rows or column wise or i can extract some of the rows or some of the columns or some of the data so or some of the fields you can filter all these things can be done in excel sheets so that we will see one by one what is happening in this case so in that spreadsheet calculations the first one is nothing but the vasi calculator users delete deleted in watching the program propagate changes across the screen so you have the chance to change the window also so sometimes we will take some of the rows and some of the columns will be put in the diagrams for example best example if you are watching the cricket now it is 2020 is going on so what's happening what they will be showing every sometimes the bowler each one bowler they are bowling so first over what happened for that bowler second over what happened third over what happened and fourth over what happened in which over they got the wickets all these things they can show it with the diagram representation all these things excel sheet they can be they can use and they can do it. so that is one and with respect to batsman side batsman side they will be putting per over how many runs they have scored so our last 5 years how many overs they have scored for how many runs they have scored last 10 overs or enter aggregate all these things they can show with the diagram representation sometimes we'll get uh, uh, they will put it circle so how many runs the batsman scored maximum runs or bowler which side they bowled it so when they got the wickets all these things analysis they can done that is what the deleted watching the program propagate the changes across the screen so we can change across the screen based on your requirement what you want to project what you want to show to the audience with respect example cricket i told you in some cases special re representation provide a better model of reality so some cases what will happen is special representation spatial that is nothing but the spatial representation is over the special representation so how you can show the better way so that is what we need to we can do it so successful spatial data management system depend on choosing appropriate so these are all the words icons so what is the icons that one graphical representations 
so you can show the graphical representation natural and comprehensive data layouts so natural and comprehensible data layouts also we can show it so that's what finally they will be showing bowler each bowler how many overs they run it how much how many runs batsman scored and what is the average per hour over how many runs the bowler they have given the similarly for batsman also so how many balls they faced which batsman which bowler they bowled it so each bowler how many runs they scored or uh, even so they want to show the pictorial representation all these things can be shown that is what this one icons graphical representations natural and comprehensible data layouts next so this was the excel sheet already you know that manipulations data how it can be done so this is what the way of doing so we can do the filters extract the data and showing the diagrams all these things can be done we can do it so this one one called one example called the spreadsheet first one is called the manipulation with the word processor second one is called the spreadsheet now we'll move to the next one is called the spatial data management so data management you can see here three four diagrams are available so three four diagrams is available if you see this is one window this is one window this is one window in this something here is available so all these things so data management so data management how to show it so there what will happen live program will be there batsman bowler when they are moving so some pictures they will show it so that this bowler how many bowl how many balls they bowled uh, how many wickets they got it and each bowler how many runs so parallel they are showing the similar question here also they have the data management how they will be showing that's all so some of the cases when you are using even our system also will open many files say now for example if you take for me on day this is called ppt so this is called you have the a word so uh, for example i am having the mail id is for this so i am having the this one so all these things windows i can show it so for example if you are having this so just i'll tell you the example so i can make it the two windows can you able to in your laptop do you got it two windows do you got it or not hmm do you got two windows sahadev can you able to see the two windows yes sir yes, yeah sir. this is not the that one so here is spatial data management is nothing but what different windows different managements so here is i've shown you now this is called ppt now i can show excel sheet i can show some other for example this one let me say one more browser i can open it otherwise mozilla i can open it otherwise suppose for example if you see here what will happen what what it is visible now for you people sahadev what is visible some questions some questions is yes, some question yeah yeah questions are available right so that means what how you are managing how you are showing the windows so multiple windows i can show at a time or oh, i can switch over one to another that's what i mean to say that's all spatial data management is nothing but what this is what this one now first one is called the word processor second one is called the spreadsheet and third one is called the spatial data management so here you have one window in that window they are showing something so maybe like uh, water is going on they want to show they can show it or some roads they want to show it they can show it now recently we are seeing because of the rain some states they have shown so hyderabad for example if you take so heavy rain they are, they are showing so some houses are they were lost and uh, see how heavy rain it seems so in tv if you are seeing what will happen they will be reading and they will be showing the pictures so three four different pictures somewhere what how it is going or somebody 
how they are struggling. So they want to highlight the pictures, they can show it. So in the same window, they will be showing more than three or four windows also. So four, three, four pictures at a time, sometimes five, six pictures. So at a time they want to show it. So like video conference only. Suppose if you are, um, you made it, your video is off. Suppose if you are making video on means on photos, I can be able to see it. Now my, my case, if you take it, what happened? Audio, video, both is available. So you can be able to hear or you can be able to see the teacher also. The similar fashion, you can, even you can do it. So in your systems, for all present, every photo is visible. So that with the here also, different tasks. That is called the spatial data management. So you have the, you can show it the multiple windows, multiple tasks. That is what the meaning. So multiple tasks is nothing but the, also possible here, the, how you are giving the interfaces, how you are giving the links, how you are moving one window to another window. All these things that is called the interfaces they give on the systems. Now uh, sometimes I will press Alt tab. See, Alt tab, the previous window it is moving. So sometimes see here many are there. I can move to which one I want. See, I can be able to see it here, documents, UID. So I want to make this, I can come here. So for example, if I am showing here, so let me say this one. So this one, see, UID one. So I want to PPT, I can come back to PPT. So that is what the happening. So this is called the spatial management. Now, next one is called the video. So this is called the fourth one, video games. So video games, I think not required for you people the explanation because you are familiar with the video games. You are familiar with the video games. What surprise? Surprise. Surprise. Ajay. Ajay. May can you I am speaking, sir. Uh, but I am not able to hear you, no. Your voice is not audible. Video also not coming. Uh, what video games you have played? Many games? Oh, I am playing. Played many games, sir. Naming only a bit. Yes, sir. Huh? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Uh, correct. So there also manipulation is happening. Because you have in your mobile, sometimes you will be playing the games. Or in your system, you are playing the games. So now that is the reason every kid they want uh, mobiles, they want to play the games or they want to uh, watch the videos or they want to see some other things. So whatever it means, that is the reason many people are asking. So system means it will take some time, we have to sit somewhere and we have to do it at home only. So somebody will be monitoring what you are doing. So if it is system, more system means this one, if it is computer means no problem at all. So we can lock the door, whatever we want, we can do it. So whether we can play the games or we can uh, play the videos or we can see the movies. So whatever you want, you can do it. So that is what happening. Video games also, same oddly. So that is also, that means what here is, how they have done the interface. So games also, how they have done the interfaces. So, Nintendo, Y, Sony, PlayStation, and Microsoft, Xbox. So these are the video games, names, some of the actions where it is available. Field of action is visual and compelling commands are physically actions whose results are immediately shown on the screen. So you know that the rules, regulations, uh, you have to read the rules, regulations, how you have to play it, how you will be getting the ma uh, score, how you will be getting the failure, how you will be getting the success, all these things you have to read the rules, regulations, how to play that particular game. So when you are going for the online, what you will be doing, first we will read the instructions, how to play, how to get win for that. So even online somebody will pay cards, somebody will be pay, playing the games, so whatever they want, they can be able to do it. That is what the video games, 
so no syntax to remember here for us not required to remember any syntaxes for the games so somebody has developed it so only thing is what we have to do is we have to take that and we have to enjoy that that's all we have to play that's all so we are not remembering any which software they have used which platform they have used we are not bothered for that so just only thing is we have to enjoy for that that's it okay so another 5 minutes no so i'll stop now i'll take that and as next class we'll see so i have to take one day one hour extra so when to take you tell me either friday saturday fourth hour or next week or the thursday i'll take continuously two hours because i missed some of the classes last week i went to my hometown i couldn't able to take so that classes to be compensated answer attendance to yes sir 3 yes sir 4 yes sir 5 present sir 6 apurva 7 sir 8 yes sir 9 9 10 yes sir 11 11 go to me 12 yes sir 13 14 15 present sir 16 present sir 17 present sir 18 Present sir. 19, 20, sir. Present sir. 32. Rajesh, what happened? Is not attending. Or Sahadev, sir. What happened, Rajesh? Sahadev, why is not attending the classes regularly? Any idea? Okay, 25. He is not well, sir. He is under isolation. Oh, okay. Okay, ma'am, no problem. Let him take care. So, twenty-six. Santosh, absent. Twenty-seven. Seema. Twenty-eight, twenty-nine. Sanjana. Present, sir. Okay. So, just for me. Ah, right, sir. I can able to see your name according to starting the register numbers. Study for registration is absent. Fifty. Present sir. Registration is present, ha? Eh? Amrita. Hmm. Registration also is visible. Okay, no problem. Fifty uh, one. Present sir. Fifty two. Present sir. Fifty three. Yes, sir. Fifty-four. Fifty-five. Tavia. Fifty-six. Present, sir. Fifty-seven. Present, sir. Fifty-eight. Surprise. Present, sir. Fifty-nine. Present, sir. Fifty-sixty. Present, sir. Sixty-one. Present, sir. Sixty-two. Present sir. Sixty three. Sixty three. Sixty four. Present sir. Sixty five. Sixty six. Present sir. Sixty seven. Pratik absent. Sixty five. Sixty eight. Shashank. Sixty nine. Sadha, seventy. Present sir. Seventy one. Present sir. Seventy two. Present sir. Seventy three. 
73 उमेश हनी 75 74 डेविड 76 प्रेजेंट सर 77 प्रेजेंट सर राइट सर हाउ सर 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 स